I've been in the network industry since 19, oh, about 94. And I have never seen such excitement around a set of technologies in all those years as I have right now with data center or cloud technologies. In this micro nugget, I'm going to guide you through the CCNA data center, a perfect way to get your start in the world of data center technologies. Now, before I say anything about what it takes to get your data center certification from Cisco Systems with the CCNA data center, before I guide you through the requirements and, and all the exam stuff, I've got to answer a question that I have been absolutely getting hammered with on my social networking sites, and that is, will CBT Nuggets provide CCNA data center training? And the answer is a resounding yes. In fact, you heard it here first. This training starts July 18th of 2013. That's right. CBT Nuggets will begin training on this exciting certification from Cisco on July 18th. Now, another follow-up question that I get is, okay, when will the training be done? I'm not so sure, but I can tell you this. You don't have to wait for the series to be done. Remember, at CBT Nuggets, there's always going to be, under the video training, an upcoming videos area. And you can start watching, as a subscriber, those videos as they're complete. For instance, if you look at my Microsoft Project series, you'll see that I've got nine of them done, and I'll be doing a tenth one later today, by the way, so we could start watching those as they're produced. So please be aware, July 18th, 2013, Nuggets start appearing on this exciting CCNA data center. So now that we've got that burning question out of the way, let's go take a look at the CCNA data center certification. Here at the Cisco.com homepage, we're going to go to training and events. And on the training and events page, we're going to go to training and certifications. I recently met the person that's responsible for these product pages at Cisco.com and I let them know just what an amazing job they're doing with organizing the many different certifications up there. Here we can see our certification tracks and sure enough we see an entire track dedicated to data center. There it is right here. Let me get the right drawing tool. There it is, data center, right here. So what we're interested in is the associate level data center certification. So we'll choose CCNA data center, and this brings us to our overview page. Notice there are no prerequisites to the data center certification. So pretty unique, right? No prerequisites for this particular cert. What we need to do is we need to pass two exams, Introducing Cisco Data Center Networking, or DCICN, and Introducing Cisco Data Center Technologies, or DCICT. This is 64911 and 64916, respectively. Two exams with no prerequisites, and we've achieved the CCNA Data Center Certification. As you might guess, CBT Nuggets will be providing all of the training and more that would be required to pass these exams. The CBT Nugget training approach will focus on building an amazing foundation for you with data center networking, and passing these exams will just be a simple byproduct of that amazing foundation level training that CBT Nuggets will provide. Now, I don't know about you, but don't you find it a bit strange that all these other tracks here that we can see, like routing and switching and security and service provider and video and voice, most all of the other tracks, have the prerequisite of the CCENT certification, but for data center and for video, that's not the case. Well, in the case of data center, the CCENT or ICND1 certification is not a prerequisite because if we go and look at this first exam, the 64911 exam, and you take a look at the exam topics, you'll see that a lot of these are indeed covered by the CCENT. So there is quite a bit of overlap. 
But I'll tell you, this particular exam does indeed go into some real particulars on the details of the NX OS operating system. That's right, the Nexus operating system and even some of the hardware devices that would run this NX OS operating system. So there's this misconception out there that in order to pass 649.11, all you need to do is study CCENT material. Please, you hear, heard it here first. This is indeed a misconception. And in the CBT Nuggets material, we'll be covering the foundation of the Nexus operating system. And this is information you wouldn't want to miss for both your real world data center networking as well as the certification exam. Now, what about the other exam? The other exam we know is 64916. And when you look at the exam topics here, you won't find any carryover with any other CCNA or CCENT materials. Notice we're going to be covering things that are very, very specific to data center technologies, things like Cisco's Fabric Path, which is actually their implementation of Trill. We'll look at things like virtual device contacts and virtual port channeling. We'll cover in-depth fiber channel over Ethernet. And you'll learn what fabric extension is all about and why FEX is such an incredibly important technology in Cisco's data center networking. By the way, as we look at this structure of this particular exam, we see it covers an awful lot. And of course, this will help guide us in the structure of our CBT nuggets to make sure we're covering everything that the exams might cover. And we always go that extra step. Now, let's conclude this micro nugget with just a quick, quick glimpse of why data center technologies are so darn exciting. I think why this is the biggest, most exciting area of technology that's come along in a, in a while is because it's really going to redo how we think about even the smallest of server closets. That's the thing. Data center technologies, it's not just about Google and Yahoo and all these amazing data centers that make the headlines. It's about a small mom and pop shop. This little small mom and pop shop has this little server area and they've got a traditional tower and maybe that's due an exchange. And then they've got their database over here on this tower and then they've got some legacy software running over here on this tower. Just three towers, but still, these things are consuming a lot of power. Their parts aren't all that reliable. It's a real nightmare for this little mom and pop to maintain these three servers. What do they do? They get rid of that. They install one very efficient blade server. They put VMware as an example of several technologies that could be installed in this blade server. And then they run these services in virtual machines on this one single piece of hardware. This is a small mom and pop shop and it works beautifully for them. You can only imagine how awesome this could scale for a massive organization. So data center technologies are coming to a server closet near you, and I suggest you be ready for this revolution with the CCNA data center certification complements of Cisco systems. And when it comes to mastering that material, turn to no other than CBT Nuggets. I hope this has been informative for you, and I'd like to thank you for viewing.